What's going on world? This is Tanya Faxit from Legacy Changers bringing you another daily update. So uh, my hair was really, really short and I've been trying to grow it out for some time and although it's gotten longer, I've gone through this really weird up and down process, right? So uh, I get so frustrated with that middle of the road, ladies, I know you can understand, um, of the growth, growing hair, that I got to the point where I'm like, I'm just going to chop it off, you know, but I really want my hair back, you know, I want it long. So one of my friends put some twists in my hair, Ooh, see, so, uh, you know, besides being excited that, you know, my <laughs> I don't have to necessarily, one, either do my hair as much, um, I can give my hair a break, but you know, that I also have that in between stage, you know, automatically what came up inside me was like, what are people going to think when they see this, you know, light skinned Puerto Rican girl, um, you know, with these twists and braids or whatever in her hair and, you know, and then it, and it kind of brought, you know, a little bit of, of, an awareness to myself that, you know, I still care what people are thinking enough to kind of feel awkward. Uh, so that's, that was a red flag for me. And I thought, well, why not share it with all the leaders that I mentor right now? Um, and even new people that are watching this right now that, uh, you know, we can do the same thing with our life, with our business. And um, for those of you that don't know, I, teach through LegacyChangers.org. Uh, uh, I teach uh, entrepreneurs, um, leaders, uh, and individuals who want to get off of their job, and I'll tell you my story one day, um, that want to get off their job, and I teach them and, and I coach them in equipping them to do that. And it's through blogging, it's through uh, helping them build a voice, you know, and I notice that so many people, when I when I go to coach them, their first reaction is one, yes, what am I going to talk about? Because I want people to, you know, respond and like me, and um, I don't know if I want to show my family the blog because you know I don't know um, if they're going to support me in the business and and that type of thing. And because uh, we don't do just any blogging, we we you know the way that we the platform that we have is to allow you to blog, but yet build an income and then all the things that you're learning and the leadership skills that you're learning uh, social media skills all those skills take them and equip your own team to help them get financially free and so you know I just want to just put it out there and say that we have to be confident with what we present and the best way to do that is to be comfortable with yourself so you know whenever you're blogging whenever you're doing videos whenever you're doing any of that and you know you're you're promoting yourself really you know your business yourself you know you can get a little just a little nervous you know are people going to receive you but the truth of the matter is there will always be judgment there will always be people who don't receive you so in all retrospect you know the individuals that do receive you are the ones that want to have you coach them or reach out to them or however you know it may be so you're gonna attract the right people so if you want to talk about health then talk about health and and what your passion is because in the end of the day you want to build a business off of your passion and you want to have your business is supposed to be that platform that brings you to another place of where you're called to be um, you know, I, I, I first I thought that, you know what, it would just be, you know, I would just write my feelings. Uh, then I had this passion to help other individuals do the same thing that I was doing and be financially free and be at home like I am, you know. Um, and then, you know, it got even larger than that. Now, you know, you know, I, I'm about to finish authoring my first book. Um, there's well, really my second book, you know, so. I mean, it just starts getting bigger and bigger and bigger. But you know what drives me is the foundation part of it all, the passion that I have behind, you know, my business and uh, the fact that I'm not afraid anymore to just say this is what I do and I love it. And, you know, if you don't want to, that's fine. But, um, you know, if you do. I want to support you and be that person that comes up alongside of you. Um, you know, according to the stories, my, my testimony, which I'll definitely share with you one day, uh, 
you know, I didn't have anyone. And so it became very difficult. So just wanted to encourage you and uh, check us out at LegacyChangers.org. You can also look at the link below. So uh, have fun. Have fun. Vlog, video, do you, be you, no matter your age, no matter your religion, no matter your whatever. Um, you know, just be you because somebody loves you. <laughs> All right. Have a great day and um, have fun. <laughs>